Hi everyone and welcome back to another episode of Tastefully Balanced. I'm Miriam and today we are making a delicious and savory cranberry feta salad with a homemade Dijon vinaigrette. Once you make this Dijon vinaigrette at home, you'll never go back to buying it at the store. Seriously, it's so easy and it's so good. So definitely if you like salad recipes with homemade salad dressing, please subscribe and keep watching. Welcome back. So for this salad, it's really simple, very easy. I have in front of me a mix of spring mix, which is just arugula and different kinds of uh, lettuces. And then I just added some shredded carrots to it. So that I'm gonna put aside. First, I'm gonna make the dressing. And you guys know that making your own dressing is the best because you can control all the ingredients, you know exactly what goes inside of it. So I have my mason jar. To that, I'm going to add oil. Then I'm gonna add Dijon mustard. So this is a Dijon vinaigrette that we're making. Then I'm gonna add some lemon juice. some red wine vinegar, and then a little bit of minced garlic. Okay, so I'm just gonna close that up and give it a good shake. All right, so since it's just my husband and I tonight, I'm not gonna make the full recipe that you'll find on tastefullybalanced.com. Instead, I am halving my recipe, and then for the dressing, I'm just gonna use the dressing that I need just for the taste test. So, uh, in front of me, my salad, I'm just gonna add some cranberries, sunflower seeds, and crumbled feta, which I bought in a block and crumbled myself. So I highly recommend you do it that way instead of buying it crumbled, but it is easier. Okay, so that is good. And so what I'm gonna do, because I don't want to add all the dressing in this at once and wait until it's ready for dinner so it's nice and fresh, I'm just gonna take a little bowl for my taste test and make sure that I get a good serving of everything. So in this, I've got my lettuces, my arugula, some feta, sunflower seeds, and then I'm just gonna add my vinaigrette. And just a little bit goes a long ways with this recipe. So that looks great. And then a good way of kind of making this a full meal is adding chicken. So I actually have some vegan chicken tenders that I just bought. They're the Gardein, um, I think that's the brand, Gardein. I think I showed it actually in my Whole Foods haul. So if you check that out, you'll see exactly what these are. But I like to add them because they're easy to cook up and they taste delicious. So there you guys go. That would be a full meal for me. Of course, I'd have more salad, but now let's taste test. And I love the combo of feta cheese and cranberries. I don't know what it is, but it just is perfect. That dressing is so delicious and so, so simple to make, seriously. You don't have to go out and spend three, four dollars on a bottle if you can make a batch of this. And you can see that I made quite a bit. So it's gonna last you more than just this recipe. You can keep it in the fridge for a couple weeks and it'll be good to go. So if you guys are liking this series, the salad series, please comment, like, share, and subscribe. And as always, live life tastefully balanced. 